to restore the cat, we need to put this uh, gasket, the new one, down in the hole here. Like that. So when it's pressed, it will seal. Next, we're going to put this uh, new gasket to the engine exhaust manifold holes. Now I have got the uh, gasket on, so you can remember, so this is a uh, rather square, so this is on the, if you look at the engine, it's on the up right corner. Yeah, I think this is the only uh, orientation you can put it on when the four holes are aligned uh, very well. If you put it any other way, uh, the holes won't be aligned, so uh, you won't miss it. Next, we can try to manage to put this uh, into the position over there through this uh, big hole against uh, all the pipes. Now, I managed to get it uh, into the position at the bottom into the exhaust pipe. There are the two studs at the bottom, you see there, they get into the bottom uh, two holes of this uh, new cat. This is the side bracket for the cat. As you can see, it should be put over there, and there's a hole on the engine body, and uh, we can fix one nut on the cat, and one bolt on the uh, engine body and you can see we have a, a new bolt but whenever you put it on there and if the cat is in the position aligned very well and this bracket will be out of the hole so this I think uh, maybe the cat is a little bit uh, diameter is bigger than the original I think I will cut this uh, bracket so that the hole will be aligned with the hole over there. Now I have cut a piece out of the bracket and also I use the file to round all the edges and hopefully now it should be okay to be aligned very well with the holes. Uh, two bolts uh, and two nuts for the cat. The same is still in uh, good condition and uh, I will reuse them so it looks uh, no rust uh, on the thread. Now I have all the bolts in place as it can be seated on the top without any obstruction uh, after I cut that one. So as you can see here, the bracket is in the hole and everything in the position and uh, next I'm going to tighten the bolts and nuts up so these two bolts and the two nuts for the cat should it be tightened to 24 newton meters to tighten uh, bolts and nuts for the cat I'm using a 5 to 25 newton meter torque wrench extension flexible link and a 12 millimeter socket. Next, we're going to put these two bolts into the position. I have got some uh, anti rust uh, grease on those thread. So I have got the two bolts on, and this need a 14 millimeter socket and need to be torqued to 45 newton meters. So now I think uh, it's all. We have got uh, all the bolts and nuts uh, tightened, and uh, the rest of the things is that uh, we're going to put the front bumper back. Okay, just the final notes. So the first time you use your car, you either run for ten minutes at a fast idle, or drive for eight miles to prolong the life of the converter. This is the sticker from the new cat.